Hey guys and welcome back to Total War Arena. I've got some cool stuff I want to show you. I've got some tier 4 artillery to work with. Siege weapons, siege engines, whatever. In fact, they're just catapults or... Oh, I can't pronounce the other pronunciation. It starts with an O. It's like Onager or something. Okay, catapult. We'll stick with that. And my friend Blunk is actually in here, but we're not actually in a party. We just ended up on the same team. I'm not sure if he's going to recognize me or not. I said hello. Anyway, I'm spawning at number one. This is a really cool map because it's got the city and also a big open field over here. And uh, I guess it'll be good gameplay to show you guys what the siege weapons are like. Basically, it's kind of like if you've ever played World of Tanks or... Uh, armored warfare and you had artillery with that circle kind of thing. It's like that you'll get a good idea really soon Here of what's like here. We go. I'm gonna go into my alternate fire mode check this out See it's even got the circle. It's like world of tanks. It's ridiculous But check how far away it goes all that range right there. It's insane This is a uh, Roman artillery, but the Greeks also get artillery at uh, Tier 4 I keep on calling it artillery. I hope you guys don't mind but the Greeks also get artillery at tier 4, and uh, their range is even more impressive than this. Like, it would go all the way out to here sort of thing. So I'm just going to wait for enemies to appear. There's some dudes over there. I can't reach them. I can see my maximum range. It's just at the end of that line right there. So I hope that they're going to allow... I need Blunka to allow the enemy to come uh, into the middle of the city. That'd be nice. Although my top flank is kind of weak. Weak ass over here. We got some phalanx. Nice. That's gonna be really good protection. Can I hit these guys? <gasps> I can. All right. Watch this shit. We're gonna launch right in there in anticipation that they might come in that direction. Oh my god, they're falling back. That's fine. We've got unlimited artillery. We got unlimited rocks. But check that out. All those rocks right there, right? That that was a lot of damage. Erwin Rommel. Erwin Rommel. It's a bit a uh, few centuries, actually a few millennia. Or her out of his time. <laughs> I don't know. He went through a time machine. Uh, I can't hit anything right now. I'm sorry, guys. Nothing's within my range. I gotta wait till they come this way. This guy set up some. He's got some uh, some tier five artillery. I think that's architecti or something like that. And they can set up traps and also put down these light siege weapons. They mostly do a lot more knockback than anything else. But yeah, I'm still just waiting here for something to go down. Actually, I might be... No, I can't really hit over this wall. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. There has to be a good opportunity sometime. Eventually, these guys will get pushed into... Oh, no! Blanc is charging his horsemen into freaking phalanx! I'm not sure if that's a good idea. It looked like he was okay. But normally, phalanx are like super duper defensive. And super duper own, you know? I'm still not hitting shit. Okay, we got cavalry. <gasps> Here we go. We're putting on my consumable, which is flammable. Oh my god, it might miss. Flammable rocks. Boom! Oh! Okay, not all of them are dead. It might look like people are dead. But in fact, what happened was a lot of them got knocked down to the ground. The bodies, though, uh, yeah, those are dead. If they're sitting on the ground, then they're dead. <laughs> If they're not getting up, yeah, they're definitely dead. Okay, I'm going to select one at a time, so I'm going to try to make this most accurate as possible. We're going to drop it like it's hot. We're going to drop it like it's hot. Come on. Oh my gosh. This guy, Mayan, is getting massively flanked here. And I know I'm killing some of his guys right now, but like... Honestly, dude, there's a lot more enemies right there, so... We like to call it collateral damage. Uh, by the way, there's... Horsemen coming my way. Oh shit. Oh no, the other siege dude is getting wrecked. Oh! Holy balls, great balls of fire. Indeed. Great balls of fire. Oh no. Oh no. We got phalanx though. Okay. Uh, defend myself. <laughs> I don't think I can. Uh, there's a minimum range, you know? Oh, they're like, oh shit, phalanx. <laughs> That's amazing. I love that. Red, red. Red and red. What's his name? Red on red. Oh, wait. Hold up. Watch this. Watch this shit. I'm going to try to predict where they are. My siege weapons do shitloads of damage to cavalry. Oh, I didn't quite hit him directly hit, but it was off, off the side. Look how many I still managed to kill, though. Not bad. Uh, can I reach these guys in the middle? No, I can't. They're going all around kind of places. 
flanking through the streets and whatnot. I like how you can hear the stampede, like their footsteps. It's pretty cool. But they got to be uh, a little bit wary here because this horse is coming in. But these phalanx are so ridiculously powerful. He's actually turned around in anticipation of getting flanked. But the phalanx are so ridiculously powerful. All right, can I reach these guys? I could have reached these guys. So I'm going to try to anticipate where they might be. I'm launching all my catapults. Uh, different areas. Just to get a bigger spread. Knock back some guys. That killed some. Knocked down some. Hello. I think we're missing uh, a catapult here. One of mine didn't fire. God damn it. Okay, here we go. We got some of these dudes. So one at a time, one at a time. Gonna try to place these up ahead. Predict exactly where they're going. Oh yeah, baby. Let that pain come on down. I killed a little bit of guys, not a whole lot. But I see a number of javelin dudes. Now I'm gonna put on the burning oil. This is usually good against people who are in an area. So like knights and stuff. Not knights, but you know, swordsmen. If they're in a... Stationary combat. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Just scorches the area. It's actually important that I do this as well. Oh my god, they're moving up. Alright, I've gotta lay down the hotness. I think, uh, for lightly armored targets like these skirmishers, it's better to use just a hot coal on top of them. Oh boy. Unfortunately, I lost that sight on them. My guys are running through the fire. Look at that friendly fire right there. Ha! Huh, they're running through the fire, friendly fire. That's funny. What a play on words. Okay, well, I have no freaking clue where... The uh, skirmishers went. We're down on men compared to them. They got a thousand. We got 800. But then again, we got siege weapons. So siege weapons automatically means you have less people than they do. Can I reach these guys? I think they're out of my range. Are they? Mm, almost. I think I can hit something. Ugh, not in time though. Nah, that's out of my range. I would love to move my stuff around. But uh, I think that might be a bad idea because I've got protection here. This guy's moving his stuff. Uh oh, here we go. We got people coming. <gasps> okay, we're gonna have to predict this really, really well. Fire! Oh, that didn't kill enough! That was not enough. Okay, the phalanx are turning around at least. Okay, prediction, prediction. Please. Uh oh. He's trying to come all the way around. This is gonna be really dependent. <laughs> right into the house. This is gonna be really dependent on the phalanx. Your freaking phalanx, dude! Get your phalanx! Red on red! What the fuck? What are you doing? He's falling asleep. And now my guys are like losing morale. They're scared as shit. Okay, we're gonna abandon this, this stuff. Uh, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop the artillery, guys. Okay, they're running away. They see the phalanx coming in. It's tense, man. It's tense. It's tense. Okay, now I can grab my stuff again. Oh, his guys got, like, slaughtered. He still has three. I think you need a minimum of three guys on a catapult to make it work. Come on, dude. Protect us. Protect us. Because I can still lay down pain on these guys. Okay, I'm going to predict that they're going to go in this area. Please. We need revenge. Sweet revenge. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> oh, no. Kind of. I can kind of see them. Come on. Get ready. Oh, yeah, baby. We killed a few of them. Look at that. All the horsies on the ground. I don't hate the horsies. I hate the guys riding the horsies, all right? And now we've got some battles going on in the middle. Oh my sweet Jesus. This is perfect. Watch this. If they stay still, this is going to be huge. Oh, please stay still. Oh no, Blanca is going to go right into my fire. Ha 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 Wee wee. Oh no. But Blanca's is taking shitloads of friendly fire because of my fire. Look at this. God damn it. Okay, we're not going to use the flaming stuff. We're going to predict that it will be there. I might kill a lot of them. Please. 
Come on, rocks. Boom. We got bodies. Oh, we got bodies. <laughs> Look at all the bodies. I'm not a sadistic person, I swear. Okay, we're gonna do this one at a time. Try to predict where they're going. Please, Blanca, don't go backwards. We got some. We got more. Ah, that's fine. I think I accidentally killed one of Blanca's horses. I'm sorry, Blanca. One of your horses for like 20 of theirs. Sounds like a good trade to me. Okay, we're gonna throw down some artillery on top of these dudes. Hello. Ah, that missed. That missed. You need some pretty good prediction skills here. It missed again, this fucking piece of shit. Oh my god, Blanca. Okay, I think we're 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 okay. All right, can I attack these guys, please? They're just out of my range. Blanca's got the horses. Some battling going on here. Horses versus uh, men on the ground. I think uh, our men might win. I don't know, but I'm gonna throw it down anyway. Because my catapults wreck horses. Like, seriously, wreck horses. Shit, just crashed into the building. <laughs> my guy's gonna lose his units as well. I think I killed more of my teammate than I killed the horses. I'll be honest with you guys. <laughs> that was bad. Oh no. The skirmishers are getting ready. Look how far they are as well, dude. Or look how close they are, rather. I need to kill him. But I don't- they're, they're out with my minimum range. Where's the other phalanx? There's phalanx over here. If we can- oh my god. If he gets it around here. Here. Oh shit, he might be coming on top of the hill. Oh. Oh god. Attack! Oh no! Run! Run you pieces of shit! Drop the weapons! Drop the siege weapons! Fuck! Drop the siege weapons, I told you, you pieces of shit! Oh my god, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose all my siege weapons. This is it. This is it. Veni, Vidi. Uh, the opposite of Vici. No! No! This is terrible news! All my- oh my god, all my siege weapons are destroyed. I can't- I can't do anything now. This is- this is the beauty about siege weapons. Uh, they do shitloads of damage, they have insane range. But when they get- when the actual weapons themselves are destroyed, there's nothing you can do. There's nothing more you can do with your guys. My guys are literally useless at this point. They- they don't build anything. Uh, they- they almost do zero damage. They- and they- they have almost no morale. Okay, you know what? I'll take on the horses. Fuck you guys! Kill them! Am I even killing anything? Or what the heck is going on here? Come on! Focus down this horsey! Unit. Alright, we got one unit. We got one unit! Hey man, that's not bad! That's not bad. We lost like... Six guys for one horsey. It's actually pretty bad, but whatever. My guys are like, not armed at all. They're armed with sticks. You can actually see like, their sticks that they're holding. That's ridiculous. Alright, we're gonna go to their base. We got a minute and 28. So this match is probably gonna end like... Before anything happens, anybody properly wins. Uh, are we gonna win? I think it comes down to points in the end. I got 3,500 points. Holy balls, I didn't think I did that good. Apparently I did, but one of their guys is 6,000. No, I think they're gonna win. If this comes out to a draw, yeah, the enemy team is definitely 100% gonna win. A lot more of the people have way more points than we do. Damn. So it's pretty much gonna be a loss. Even if I try to get to their base, nothing I can do. <laughs> Instead, what we'll do for the last like minute, we'll watch these guys attack the skirmishers. Attack, horses! And there's some archers at the back. In fact, I'll bring my engineers. Come on, you pieces of shit! Help the flank! Oh no! 
And their swordsman, it got a lot of guys still. Blanca's like, I'm not going in. Oh! Hey, no horses died. Okay, maybe I shouldn't go in now. With my engineers. What are they gonna do? Nothing. Nothing at all. And this is an AI guy. See, he left. His name is a bit pale, so you can uh, control them. It's pretty cool, I guess. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Five seconds. Gonna be defeat. Would have been a better video if it was a win. But I think it was still good anyway. Oh, no. So that's some uh, siege action for you guys. Some siege engine action from the Romans. Like I said... Uh, the Greeks early on have better artillery than the Romans, but later on the Romans have better artillery Anyway guys hope you enjoyed that Pretty fun game. Did any of you start playing this game as a result of uh, my last video or this video? I don't know maybe all right dudes until the next video subscribe. I'll catch you guys next time Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Now we